Hi, I'm Sagar Khasnas, Solutions Architect in AWS Marketplace. I'm here to show you how to manage access in your private marketplace, which is a feature within AWS Marketplace. For the purposes of this video, we are going to assume that you know what private marketplace is. If you need more details about private marketplace, you can find more information through the URL on the screen. Customers who are using AWS Marketplace have frequently asked us how they can manage private marketplace access across different personas, such as procurement managers and developers in AWS accounts under multiple organizational units in AWS organizations. The next few minutes will address these questions by showing examples of IAM roles and policies that can be used in combination with service control policies in AWS organizations to manage access for your private marketplace. So the very first thing that you will need to do is set up private marketplace by logging in to the master account of your AWS organizations. You will need to use a user or a role with permissions to create private marketplace. If the IAM role or the user you use to log in is not the root user or does not have the administrator access policy, then you need to add the AWS Private Marketplace admin full access policy to that IAM entity. This is a managed AWS policy that will allow you to create a private marketplace in AWS Marketplace. Once logged in with the appropriate permissions, you can navigate to the URL on the screen to set up your private marketplace. At this point, you will be able to create the private marketplace using the Create a Private Marketplace button. This button will set up private marketplace in AWS organizations. The creation of a private marketplace needs to be initiated from the master account of AWS organizations. Once the setup is complete, it's important to note that an IAM user or a role with the appropriate permissions can administer private marketplace from any AWS account in AWS organizations. To do so, you will need to attach the AWS managed policy called the AWS Private Marketplace Admin Full Access to your IAM user or the role. Alternatively, you can choose to use a customer managed IAM policy or an inline policy so that you can provide granular permissions such as addition or removal of approved listings from private marketplace, changing the pro profile page visuals, or enabling or disabling private marketplace. All users or roles in your AWS accounts with the appropriate permissions will be able to administer private marketplace. If you want to restrict the IAM entities which administer private marketplace to a role like a procurement manager, you can use service control policies in AWS organizations to deny access to administer private marketplace for everyone apart from the procurement manager role. In effect, only the procurement manager role with AWS private marketplace admin full access would be able to administer your private marketplace. You can use the following example service control policy that restricts all IAM entities except the role named procurement manager from making any changes to private marketplace. Hopefully, you now have an idea of how to manage access for your private marketplace. Thank you for joining us. My name is Sagar Khasnis, and get started today by visiting our webpage.